In April 2017, in retaliation to chemical strikes by the Syrian government, two U.S. Navy destroyers in the eastern Mediterranean rushed into the area with 59 Tomahawk cruise missiles on board. But if the U.S. attacked Syria, Russia vowed to fire down U.S. missiles, and especially the ships that fired them. Even a retired Russian admiral was open about wanting to scuttle the sole destroyer in the area, the USS Donald Cook. However, it was a trick because the Cook didn't fire a single shot when the strike occurred on April 14, 2018. The USS John Warner SS-785, a submarine that fired missiles while submerged in the eastern Mediterranean, presented a far tougher target than a destroyer at sea. A French frigate launched three missiles in another area. The Red Sea, however, was where most of the missiles came from. A third of the 105 Tomahawk cruise missiles the U.S. claims were fired were fired from the USS Monterey, a Ticonderoga-class guided missile cruiser, and the USS Laboon, an Arleigh Burke-class destroyer. During this attack, neither Russian nor Syrian air defenses managed to stop a single Tomahawk missile.